Ooh. Oh, it's GG time, man. Not good game, but it's time for the ghost and grass type. Pokemon to be used in the Ultra League, in the Go Battle League. So, hi, hi to all of you guys. So, indeed, today we will be using Travenant, the brand new Halloween event Pokemon from Phantom. And this is actually my rank 2 according to Stadium Gaming. But also, according to pvpoke.com, this is actually rank 2 in the Ultra League and also in the Great League. So it is a very very strong Pokemon to use and uh, with the move Shadow Claw, Seed Bomb and Shadow Ball is just insane. I've already invested 103 Candy XL into this Pokemon and it is at level 44.5. So let's go ahead into Ultra League to search for a battle right now and this is the team I'll be using. I did mention in my previous video though that I was going to use it with Swampert and Galarian Stunfisk, but I decided to change it instead to use Talonflame and Empoleon. But I'm going to lead with Talonflame. Usually I lead with the showcased Pokemon, but today I'm going to lead with the Talonflame instead. As um, it's better to burn shields than uh, using Trevenant. And um, there are a lot of uh, duck typing Pokemon that I encountered also during the last few sets that I've played. So let's go ahead to enter and look for an opponent right now. So Trevenant, like I said, it is rank 2, which is very, very sick. The one that is ahead of it, I think, is Registeel. So it's still crazy, though, to think that this Pokemon, it is rank 2, not just in the Ultra League, but also in the Great League. And I have one that is also rank 2 in terms of IVs. So that's a very, very huge coincidence. So we got a <laughs> matchup against the Cult Leader. Okay, I hope hope there is a Pokemon Cout and see what I mean. A lot of duck typing Pokemon. We got an Umbreon. All right, so let's go ahead to uh, farm up our damage first with our Flame Charges. All right, I'm gonna let this foul play go through. Obviously, I do not want my Trevenant to face up against the Umbreon. That wouldn't be good at all. All right, so they're gonna let this go through. I am then gonna go with my very first Flame Charge. I might actually go with Brave Bird next, depending on the situation. Alright, I might also want to shield my Talon Flame because, okay, good, very good, man. Well, we burn one shield, that's very, very good for us. So, looks like we're gonna have to start shielding right now. <laughs> yeah, so as our attack gets boosted by 25% each time we use the Flame Charge, it gets stronger and stronger each time, as in the Talon Flame. The Incinerate will deal more damage, which is really good, but. Um, Let's hope, um, you know, he's not, okay, he's not gonna shield this, obviously. And let's see now. We could actually fire off a Brave Bird if we wish to, but I'm gonna go with Flame Charges all the way, alright? I'm gonna shield this also as what I've just said. Okay. And uh, we should be able to get to our next Flame Charge, like, right about now. Okay. Excuse me, did I over that? Yes, I did. Alright, never mind, no worries. We got that Flame Charge in. Let's see this. This would probably take out the Umbreon if Ghost unshielded, but he decided to shield it. Alright, let's go ahead to fire off our next Flame Charge. We can get to our next Flame Charge because it takes 5 Incinerates to get to 2 Flame Charges. That's the interesting thing about Talon Flame, uh, you know, Flame Charge. And we took out the Umbreon and we are full. We are like really, really full on, um, on our, our damage. Let's see this. This is going to be insane, man. It's definitely going to one-shot the uh, Sylveon because we are at 200 damage increase right now, which is insane. One-shotting it. All right, let's see that. We got Grand Boo. Um, I mean, I want to show you guys the Trevenant. So what I'm going to do is actually to use my um, Empoleon first and then I uh, hope that he would actually uh, go for the uh, close combat. Okay, actually, you know what? I, 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 I was hoping that he would go for close combat to get a debuff before my Trevenant can come in and do maybe just two or three Shadow Claws to take it out, but uh, clearly that wasn't needed. So I'm so sorry. <laughs> this video was supposed to be about Trevenant, but on to the next battle, all right? On to the next battle, all right? Um, yeah, to see how Trevenant uh, actually performs. Yeah, no worries. Let's go ahead into the next battle right now. And we got matched up against an opponent already. Battle starting. Very good. Against Vincent. L. Vincent 08. Alright. So uh, let's see now. We got our Talon Flame against Polytoot. Polytoot. Seriously, what the toot? 
Not good for us, man. Not good for us. Alright. So I actually would want to go with the Brave Bird like instantly. I'm go not going to shoot this weather ball at all. Alright, I just need one more flame charge and my uh, Brave Bird will be ready. Oh my god, look at the amount of damage, man. That was sick, man. Alright, we got Brave Bird coming in right now. And I'm going to pull an immediate switch into my Trevenant like right now. Okay, good. Very good. That did a very good amount of damage to it. And we got Giratina. You guys know what? I'm going to go with the Seed Bomb Bait. I hope he shoots. I hope he shoots. Alright. I probably would want to double shield my uh, Trevenant looking at this situation right now. Okay, good. We managed to do that. Mm, I'm going to shield this. Yeah, I am. I am going to shield this, man. Alright, it's going to be Shadow Sneak. Sneaky, sneaky. Alright, but we should be slightly ahead on energy. We're going to go ahead with Shadow Ball right now. I could have actually gone with another, like, Seed Bomb bait, but... It's a 50-50 chance that he's going to shield this. Okay, he does not shield that. Woohoo! Boom! Alright, we have Atikuno coming in. That is not very good for our Trevenant because uh, we have to get to our... Shadow Ball, <laughs> if you want to deal great damage to it. And uh, what was the first Pokemon again? I, I'm trying to recall. Oh my god, that's not really good. Alright, so um, our Trevenant is going to go down. So, I'm going to bring in Empoleon to soak up the uh, charge moves first. But he's going to bring in Politoed again. Okay, sure. I think I can just farm down the Politoed. I'm gonna shield this, okay, because uh, I will be double resisting the Icy Wing or whatever moves from the from the Articuno, hence I would rather shield against the Politoed. Though, I just got like baited. Okay, sure, that wasn't a bait anymore. Alright, sure. Okay, good. And uh, we're gonna just water fall down the Articuno, guys. We are not even gonna use our charge move anymore because uh, that's not needed, like, totally. Even if it's gonna use, like, three icy winds, which is not possible because uh, <laughs> you only can do two in a row, my, uh, my Empoleon still ain't gonna faint. Alright, so that was pretty good. The Trevenant did a lot of work, especially taking out the Giratina, and we baited well with the Seed Bomb. Alright, so we got our third opponent right now. Let me drink a sip of water. Hmm. Yeah, really thirsty, man. Alright, you know, commenting, commenting like this and uh, focusing and also um, thinking of stuff to say actually uh, takes a toll on my mental energy and also on my throat. But uh, it is what it is and it's for the sake of entertainment to show you guys that woohoo, we have a very, very good start right now. Okay, cool. I do not know if that was the right play, man, to actually do that, but uh, I've done that, but... Sure. Uh, Yeah, okay. I'm gonna shoot the Shadow Snake. I, I really do not know, man, if this is the right thing to do. Alright, let's go ahead with that. I'm gonna go with a uh, Seed Bomb Bait. Okay. I might want to go with Double Seed Bomb Bait, though. I, 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 I don't know, man. Uh, let's see now. Alright, we, we baited good, we baited good, alright. We're gonna go with another Seed Bomb bait, but we're gonna have to shield this first. I have a feeling my opponent is gonna shield. So I am gonna go with another Seed Bomb bait, like I said. Okay, and then probably we can fire off the uh, Shadow Ball after that. If we can't, we'll just go with Shadow Ball instantly and uh, he's gonna have to burn a shield also. Alright, good. That was very, very good, man. That was really, really good. Okay, is, dra is the Dragon Claw gonna come in? Is the Dragon Claw enough to take us out, though? Or is it gonna be Shadow Snake? I'm not too sure. Please don't be Shadow Snake. Oh, okay, it's Dragon Claw. Ugh, ouch. That was very painful to see, but this is gonna be even more painful, man. Wow, I can't believe it, man. Both my uh, Seed Bombs, the bait was really good for this round and the previous round. Okay, good. We got Switch Advantage right now. What's he gonna bring in? He's gonna bring in the Excavalor? No. Because that would do immune damage to the Trevenant. So he's probably going to bring in his other Pokemon. Okay, he's bringing in a Trevenant. I mean, Escavilla, what Trevenant? He does not have Trevenant. I'm the one who's having Trevenant, you dummy. Alright, I'm going to bring this in. I'm going to bring this in instead. Okay, cool. I actually, you know what? The Talent Flame actually can handle the Slur Path also. So that's totally fine. But uh, we don't need to use Charge Move, right, do we? Alright, you guys know what? Let's go with Hydro Cannon, okay? Yeah, let's go with Hydro Cannon now. And then... Uh, 
the Talon Flame is gonna come out to play against the Excavillion no matter what. Okay, we're gonna have to suffer one charge move, I suppose. What does the path have again? Oh, it's been a while since I encountered someone using the path, so. Um, Flamethrower, yeah, 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 that's the interesting thing about Slurpuff that it has Flamethrower, now that I remember. Alright, can I survive at least two counters to actually get to... Okay, now I can't. <laughs> well, that wasn't necessary. And uh, I don't think I will die from any uh, charge moves. I mean, Mega Horn or Drill Run would not take my Talon Flame out, definitely. So we got Talon Flame with Flame Charge, taking charge of this battle and scoring us another win. Wow! Where's Trevenant? Trevenant, you were supposed to score the win for us. It's your video and not Talon Flames' video. Alright, well, that was a good one. Let's go ahead into the next battle right now. Battle number four. We matched up against an opponent really, really quick, really good. And we got matched up against RRB Flash. Okay, cool. I'm so sorry, guys. I'm hurting my own throat. Alright, we got. Dragon. Oh, okay, this is not good. Alright. The poison and dragon typing Pokemon. Very interesting typing. I'm trying to recall what moves it has. I don't encounter. Oh, yeah, Aquatio. Okay, that's not good. Okay, let's go with Brave Bird right now. And uh, we have a problem, man. I mean, because uh, this Pokemon is going to be a bit of a nuisance against my team. All right, let's go ahead and switch into Trevenant now since he has burned a shield. Let's see what's he going to do. The question is, what's his other move, man? All right, he's going to bring in Clefable. Let's go ahead with uh, Shadow Ball right now. Okay, let's see if he's going to shield this or not. High chance he is. High chance he is. All right. Uh, okay. No, okay, did not, did not shield that. Okay, cool. We can actually get to another Shadow Ball. I think we have to shield the next move. Actually, no, we don't have to. We got a CMP tie, and uh, he can actually fire off his charge move like right now, but luckily I was able to get the Shadow Ball in. Okay, good. Seriously, guys. All right, take me out. Take me out. I, I can't get to my next charge move already, so might as well you just take me out. But the question is, what am I going to use to take out this... Pokemon. You know what? I think Empoleon doesn't suffer super effective from any of the moves, right? I think it has poison move. If I'm wrong, then screw this battle, man. Yeah, I've screwed myself up if I actually lose this. Like, because I, I really don't think I... Yeah, I, I seriously cannot remember the moves for this Pokemon, guys. So I'm like second guessing right now. It's pretty rare for me to not know the moves. Because uh, usually I'll remember. Yeah, okay, well, we have Talon Flame coming in right now. Alright, and we have Talon Flame who is going to use Brave Bird right now. Okay, cool. Yeah, and we have double shields on our Empoleon also, so we can just shield whatever that comes in. Alright, provided, um, I mean, this is going to land. If he does not shield this, then uh, good luck to him. And well, our Talon Flame has just gone down. Okay, we're going to shield this. Okay, okay, and we're gonna take out the, uh, we're gonna take out the, uh, Sylveon, and we're gonna just drill pack the, um, the other, that, that Pokemon, this Pokemon, how do you pronounce it, Dragor, J sorry guys, I really do not know how to pronounce this Pokemon, I actually pronounced it before, when it first came out, but I can't remember how to do it anymore, Dragor, Dr Dr Dragor, D-R-A, let me look at the spelling again. Hang on, give me a sec. Okay. D R A G A L G E. Dragal Whatever. Alright, we won that. <laughs> I tried, guys. I'm so sorry. You guys know what Pokemon I'm referring to. You guys can see from the screen, but basically, it's the poison dragon Pokemon, okay? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, we got matched up against Sebastian PP96. Yeah, that's a name I definitely can pronounce. And we got matched up against Greedon. Okay, pretty good start for us. Pretty good start. Yeah, so I do not know if I want to double shield against Greedon. I mean, right now we are suffering like double resisted damage from the Bullet Seed. Though that's a move that charges up energy really, really quickly, not exactly dealing a lot of damage. So, okay, we got one flame charge in. You guys saw something pop up from the butt of the Greed, and that's so weird. 
Is it going to be crunch or body slam? Well, I'm taking it as if it's body slam. I'm going to let it go through. And then we will see how things goes. We're going to go ahead with another body slam, I suppose. So if it's going to start shielding my uh, flame charge, I'm going to start shielding the body slams also, I suppose. So we can actually fire off our next flame charge right now. Okay, you guys know what? I'm going to shoot this. <laughs> I'm so sorry, guys. I, I, I have a feeling he's going to shield my um, flame charge. So um, let's go ahead to um, shield this. All right, he managed to sneak in another bullet seat. Yeah. All right, let's go ahead to um, go ahead to um, see that he shielded up me up. All right, let's go ahead with our next flame charge. I'm gonna double shield, man. I'm gonna double shield, like seriously. All right, if he wants to play the greedy style, I'm gonna play with the greedy style. Yep, and that is uh, basically being greedy with my uh, shields and using them like on my talent flame. All right. So we got. Uh, that wasn't needed actually to get to excellent. It wasn't. It was gonna faint anyways. Okay. Now, can we survive this body slam? If we actually manage to survive this body slam, we can actually f take out the uh, greed and. Oh my god! No, actually we can't really. Actually we can. Oh oh wait oh wait wait wait! I need to fire off my flame charge. No matter what, like no matter what that comes out, like seriously, there's no way I can survive already. Look at the amount of health my uh, talent flame is left with. Oh, left with. Yeah. See, look, it died immediately. I couldn't even get to Brave Bird. Okay. Let's go ahead with our Trevenant right now against Swamp. But that's the one that is so good against it. Okay. Let's go ahead with a Seed Bomb. Luckily, he did not did not sack swap to whatever that's behind. But here we go, Trevenant. You had better take out the last Pokemon or so by yourself. Great. It is Registeel. That has lock on means you can actually go ahead to Shadow Ball its helmet off. <laughs> or whatever that you guys want to call it, the armor, alright? Yeah, guys, I'm doing my best. Alright, so uh, let's go ahead to uh, see that Flash Cannon. Ouch. Now, we have a slight problem though. Our Empoleon might suffer a Focus Blast, but I think we can survive one Focus Blast, so we should be fine. We should be fine. The question is, can we actually get to another Shadow Ball before a Flash Cannon? I doubt so. So let's go with Seed Bomb. Alright, let's go with Seed Bomb. Let's take the safer option and Seed Bomb it. Okay, cool. And then we're just gonna Shadow Claw it a few more times, a few more times, a few more times. I think it's just like maybe four waterfalls away from fainting, the Registeel from what I can see. And I think I should be able to survive at least one Focus Blast, right? Two. Okay, maybe it's five. Um, okay, crap. Okay, one more, please. Oh my god. I think I can survive the Focus Blast. I hope. I really hope. Please survive. Oh yeah. And we took it down. With five Waterfalls, not four. I counted wrongly. Especially, you know, in Ultra League, it's slightly more tanky. As in the Registeel. And wow! This team is insane, like seriously guys, seriously. It's called 5. That's very rare to see, like... I do not know when was the last time I showed you guys, like, me scoring 5 nil on a video. So, Trevenant, it's a very strong Pokemon, I must say, and uh, if you guys want to try out this team, Talent Flame with Trevenant and also... Um, and Polion, you guys can go ahead too, but uh, of course uh, I need to catch this Scraggy first. Okay, I think it's gonna be get caught. It's gonna get caught. <sighs> Why don't you stay in the ball, please? Okay, how about now? You stay in the ball, okay? We're gonna great throw you. Okay, goodbye. And we can claim the reward right now. Our rating is gonna go up to close to three thousand, not three thousand, two thousand six hundred. Imagine if it's three thousand six hundred. I'll be in legend straight away already. All right, so I think that is all that I have to show to you guys in terms of how uh, Trevenant performs. It's definitely a really, really strong Pokemon to use, not just in the Great League, but also here in the Ultra League. And if you guys are intending to use it in the Ultra League Premier Cup, yo, it's rank one. <laughs> According to PV Poke, it's just insane, man. This Pokemon is like super duper meta, like meta, 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 gross, meta, 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 and whatever you guys want to call it, meta, 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 anyway, M-E-T-A, that's, that's a meta, not, yeah. All right, so I think that is all that I have to show to you guys, man. If you guys enjoyed this video, definitely go ahead and leave a like on the video for traveling being so good. But I'll see you guys in the next episode, in the next video. All right, it's time to say goodbye, traveling.
Definitely use you in the next battle again, and the next battle again, and the next battle again, the next, 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 next,